Hello, everybody. It is I, the Waluigi Big Mac. And I am Diamond Freddy 74 And welcome back to Dead Rising Deluxe Remastered. Last time, we had quite a uh, bit of stuff happening. First thing first, we we fought the Mr. Grocery Man Steven and got the medicine for Brad. Well, we did we did a little sniper uh, target practice first. Uh, well, we attempt, well, we attempted to fight Carlito with the sniper, uh, who was using the sniper rifle, mind you. With uh, ho with uh, hockey stick and pucks, that didn't turn out too well. Out. So 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 we so we just uh, ran out to him and slapped and slashed him a bunch with a chainsaw. You know, no biggie. Then we of course had to deal with some survivors where we had regretted we, all our mistakes going to get the lovers. <laughs> yep, yep. Unfor <laughs> unfortunately, we lost the survivor. So. Uh, blame Tanya. Tanya. They changed their, They changed her AI. They changed. Uh, they changed her AI, so she no longer. So she's no longer extremely aggressive, which on one hand makes us, which on one hand can be seen as a good thing because she's no longer pissing around fighting zombies rather than following you, but unfortunately because they changed her AI to specifically the cowardly, she'll be stopping momentarily. She'll be stopped every once in a while to coward in the corner. Yep, and uh, and because she stops, she'll be uh, actually. I'm going the wrong way. Yeah, I think. Uh, yeah, she'll be stopped. Yeah, she, yeah, she'll be stopping in a corner, and uh, you know, cower in fear. Now, of and, course, it's going to always be around a horde of zombies. So. Yep, and it's going to be around a horde of zombies. So she's going to get herself pinned. We gave her a chainsaw to try and defend zombies, and unfortunately, the one. Uh, the the one survivor that died was a secret survivor. You don't get a a, uh, a call from Otis about it. Yeah, they they Even... tend to pop up when the lovers pop up. Whether you save the lovers or not, these girl these two girls are always gonna show up. And on top of that, the, the one specific survivor gets stuck in a horde of zombies right near the toy store. Yeah, we we weren't quick enough to drop uh, our carry survivor and, and unfortunately and unfortunately and unfortunately we didn't have any healing items that that we could give her because survivors can't accept mixed uh, mixed drinks but anyway we're gonna make our way to the hatchet man to deal with the fighter next psychopath which I'm hoping they made him a bit more bearable to fight because in the original he was obnoxious to fight like he I mean, was extremely, of course, uh, he was extremely of obnoxious. We, have, we of course have our biggest major change of dialogue uh, from this character as well. I personally, at this point, actually looking uh, looking it over, it's not the worst thing in the world. And it's not, it's, oh wow, they also gated this uh, place off. Oh. Well, that's besides the point. But yeah, I I really I but I really like the narrative of the original dialogue. Yeah. Hey, you, I mean, hey, the bodies are no longer covered in blood. It's only minorly covered in blood, despite the fact that they're decapitated zombies. Name it right, soldier. He actually he also get a good look at his face. You can't yeah. tell me, can you, fella? And I'll say this much. Oh yeah. It does sound like he was a voice actor. It's because yeah. you're a mole. But the dialogue was originally he calls you right. uh your Viet Cong. And then this one He says, You're nothing but a filthy communist. You son are gonna tell me where the gorilla's hideout is. By the time I'm done beating information out of you, you are gonna be begging for death to come take you away. So this guy is obnoxious in the original because he would just run around, sneak attack you, throw Molotovs at you. You already fucking doing it. Yep. Yep. Up oh, and now he's gonna try and uh Yep. This is why this boss fight is really obnoxious. All right, where the fuck are you, Cliff? There's, there's some PP stickers in here too. Oh, watch out, because the smoke does fuck you up. Oh. 
shit. I didn't mean to drop my, uh, Uzi. No. There we go. Yeah, yeah. Not as bad as before. Yeah, not as bad as the first game, where it's like, every time you hit him, he just goes, nah, I don't feel like doing it, and just hops into the fucking hole. just lost it. Everything went white. Suddenly. The war. It wasn't over. Despite the dialogue change, I always respect the Capcom for critting Cliff. Because for a psychopath, he's a very simple... Like, he... Like, all the psychopaths are just selfish pricks. This is the only one who wasn't really selfish. He's very sympathetic. He's a very sympathetic uh, psychopath. And that's something I can really appreciate. Yeah, and despite the dialogue change, I think they just probably changed it to make it more ambiguous on what kind of war he fought in. Yeah. And if anything, it kind of... If say you're playing this in the future, oh shit! You don't have to. You're not stuck on a specific war. We got left up now. Ooh. Interesting. So it's. Oh, well. Bye, chainsaw. Bye, bye. Let me pick up my chainsaw again. Well, I have too much stuff, so I can't. You know what? I can leave. I would drop the. You could easily. We could do the. So, supposedly if I hold right bumper... There we go. There we go. Yep, so we can do that there now. There are PP stickers in here, but well, there's way too many zombies in here right now to deal with the PP stickers. Yep, and if anything, I would like to grab the survivors, because you do get a decent chunk of survivors here. They but... all are cowardly, but at least these ones listen to you. I won't bother you anymore. I came to help you guys out. Really? So, we're safe now? I'll have you out of here in no time. You feel up to a little trip? Yep, so all three of these guys will follow you now. I think um, they have different dialogue depending on who you talk to. Yep. He was the closest guy I was able to talk to. Yeah, we never really showed off a judo throw too much, but that's just because, uh, A, or I'm using the P a DualShock 4, so I'm technically pressing cross. Come on! Oh, come oh, on! Oh, 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 no, no, she, I think she's stuck on something. Oh my god, she's stuck! Go. Lovely AI at, at, at the finest, folks. She, I think... <laughs> Barbara, are you stuck on a little piece of garbage? There we go. Even even if they updated the AI for this game, there's just still always the I'm gonna get stuck on something random and stupid. Yeah, despite being the cowardly, they do tend to push through zombies if you call them. Yep. Come on. Just gonna hit that guy because he has a gun. Come on! Don't, don't fence. Bad zombie. No gun. Jesus Christ! Follow me! Come on! Follow me! I'm just gonna take him through this way. Oh, something I didn't actually get to—I forgot to mention. 
with uh, Tanya and Ross, it is believed that they were attacked by a psychopath that we will encounter soon. This is specifically because it's the area that they were they were in. Oh, oh, Josh has actually uh, gave us a subtle hint on one of the psychopaths we'll be fighting. Interestingly, it's one we don't fight for a long while. Interesting. I, that's actually interesting. Yeah, but once we get to that psychopath, you'll, you'll kind of understand why there the, there is the possibility that they were attacked by this one in specific because of the area they were in. Yep. Because we find them in this area, I'm gonna, and of course, there, there is I'm a psychopath. I'm right there. I'm going to play out. There's just way too many zombies here at the moment. Yeah, considering we've seen what I've dealt with uh, in my in our in our yeah. my own little private uh, play of this game, yeah, it's better we kill these amount of zombies here. Yeah, so they sh I should be able to. There we go. I judo through them. Hey, hey, Josh is throwing punches. Okay, he's, you know, he's, you know, he's not too bad. Yeah, they are. Oh, Jesus there. Christ! There we go. I'm distracting them. Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Glad, glad you can spam that. I think they should be close enough. Yeah, all of them should be close enough. Worst case scenario, I can, uh... Oh, oh! God! No, this is, like, the worst timing! Now of all times? I didn't even see any of their posters. Oh, yeah, there are there, so... Hopefully, hopefully. Okay, I'm hoping it does not uh, spawn me and the survivors near the cultists. If it does, you just gotta send them in a different direction. There shouldn't be zombies in this area. Yeah, hopefully. In the original, all, all the zombies are despawned from this general area, and only the cultists are there. Unfortunately, I only have a melee weapon, so I have to be very careful when fighting these fuckers. Yeah. Huh? I love the I uh covered war you know. <laughs> A non believer in our midst. Um, guys, we we can talk about this, you know. I don't like I don't I don't like those creepy looks you're you're giving me. That salvation. Look at all those discount ghost faces. Spill his blood. The blood of the heretic. Yep. I love his crystal. Yep. Like it's like a little gem on the there. That's like a uh, oh, okay. third eye. Okay. Okay. So. I'm gonna have my survivors run over there. Uh, they are, I think, okay, uh, I would help the, yeah. Okay, they're, they're coming, they're coming, they're, they're hauling okay, so... okay, now we gotta... Yeah, they're, they're, I think it'll be fine. Yeah, so, honestly, if anything, I'm gonna have my survivors stay, stay right there, because there's no zombies right there. Okay, well, I think we. I think they're good. I think they'll be good. We they'll they'll be good, but these to... zombies right here are too busy shambling towards uh, our survivors. So I just want to yeah, make sure. Should... Yeah, we should, we need to definitely uh, hurry to the box though, because I think you they they can fuck her up. If anything, 
I would hit and then back up quickly. Here we got a suicide bomber. My car is in the parking lot. Kind of worried. That's Bert's line. It took three hits for them. Huh? Oh, that's strange. That that survivor oh, just Oh god, we 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 one. are we okay. You know what? I don't feel like taking out these guys. Uh, I, you know what? If you get enough to come closer to you, you might be fine. Oh, there's that guy in there. Honestly, I was thinking about maybe just grabbing the Uzi and shooting them all down. Rich, what the fuck are you doing? Alright, you know what? Do it. I, I, you know what? I think we're gonna have to leave Jennifer behind. Come on, okay. Come on. I, I, I have an idea. If anything, you can get them into the... St oh, God. Rich, Rich, what the fuck? If you get, if you get oh yourself God. killed because you can't follow simple directions, I will... F and I'll... Come on. Come on. Dude, he just Come ran on. into a group of zombies. He is still cowardly. He is extremely cowardly still. Okay, you know what? I think you like... You, you... I'm trying to think. If anything, I would... Oh my god! Oh my god! You freaking moron! Push past the fucking zombies and let's get going. Uh, Jennifer is dead. I'm. She's dead to me. I. I was not expecting cultists to spawn this uh, already. I don't have the necessary tools to be able to fight them yeah. reliably. That sucks, but you know it's okay. We're not, we're not going to be able to get everyone. She's one of the easier survivors to get, but, but maybe, now, some of you guys might be wondering, why don't, some of you guys might be wondering, why am I not, like, slashing them down with a chainsaw? If you get too close to them, they can spray you with, like, some coughing gas. And, and they can, and they can put chlor, and if they do, you can, they, they can grab you, uh, hit you with chloroform, and basically kidnap you, and strip you off all your clothes and all your weapons. The worst thing is, is if you have survivors with you, the survivors will slowly die while you're trying to get back to them. Yep. Yep. So, so... if anything, risking one, uh, risking all of them for just one person, it kind of might not be the greatest strategy right now because we're not prepared for them. And who knows? Until we see her, until we see her death thing pop up, I think we'll be okay. We might be able to save her still. Hey. He took your fucking chainsaw. It's it's because it's because they don't prioritize the fucking buttons. That's the thing that uh, there should be a baseball bat up yep, here. Yeah, that's the thing that pisses me off about this game, is that. Excuse me. I'm, I'm gonna <laughs> find the devs who. <laughs> oh god. Please tell me, okay. Please tell me like. Nope, that doesn't force him to drop it. God, that is really fucking annoying. And you give it to the soccer ball. Oh, wait, give it to the soccer ball. Give me back my fucking chainsaw, you fucking idiots. Okay, we might be able to handle the cultist real quickly. Because <sighs> it hasn't said she hasn't died yet, so. I bet even that machete Up to end. was just a nice old man before all this happened. Yeah, he was. Okay, I'm going to head out so we can get the other guy. Cause not all of them made it in. Fucking idiot, Rich. Rich is the problematic one of this bunch. Thanks for saving me back there. Next time, don't be a you're fucking lucky moron. Nice. Yeah, we're, you're lucky. You're lucky. I didn't just cut your head off for for not following simple instructions. Yeah, we got a couple of minutes before another source. If anything, we might be able to still save. Our box victim. Not, not if these fucking zombies piss off. God. 
folks, we're in that frustrating range of Dead Rising where, where this game just gets downright stupid with it. Yeah, luckily I'm not the one playing because <laughs> I would be way worse with uh, with things right now. Die. The best thing would be the cultists to spawn near me and the boxes being un unattended. I mean... Yeah, they did spawn near you, so let's see if the boxes... Let's just speed past them. Oh, they... Actually, oh, God, she's about to die, so we... I really, I really think this is a bad idea, but... Well, worst comes to worst, we do have autosave that, that could, uh... We could just go back to... Yep. So... Okay, they're still around her. You know what? Let's take the rest Actually, out. hold on. There's a... Oh. Fucking zombies, piss off. Ah, uh, no, there's... I, I can't, I can't do it. I, I... This is, this is way too important. Sorry, Jennifer. It, in another playthrough, we would have gotten you. Up, and we get... Here. And we also have that boss fight ready. Yep. Yep, and this is the psychopath that I was talking about. It is believed that uh, that Tanya was going to be taken by that psychopath, and Ross saved her from the specific spike psychopath. It was never confirmed, though. It just kind of feels like it. It, it probably was the reason why uh, he got shot. Yeah. So we're losing. Uh... We're losing another survivor, but it it is what it is. It is what it is. It it was just um, unfortunately it was just wrong place, wrong time sort of situation. Like they spawned in at the wrong time when I was bringing survivors back, and and while I could have saved her, I just don't have the time to be able to fuck around and try and uh, save her. Yeah, and risk getting uh, gassed. Yeah, if she's still alive, there's a sliver of hope, but considering she was, she would be on low in health, it would be like... If she was like a sliver of health, she's going to be dead by the by the time we, we save get her. to what we need to go. Yep. Yep. Now, luckily... Now, luckily, girl hunting is... is not too, too bad. Damn, Frank. But, uh, yeah. Okay. Anyway, I'm gonna toss this in. I'm tired of these fucking zombies. Don't worry, we'll get to the point where they're not gonna be a problem eventually. Oh, it's so nice to be able to move while shooting. Yep. <laughs> yeah, but if you learn us on the, uh... We still have a lot of usage of the chainsaw. Like, getting the three books... Yeah, sure, it uses up a lot of, uh... It uses up a lot of uh, storage space. 
but it is so worth it for the amount of uh, yep. hits you can Now, get I'm going to go get myself the Uzi because I think grabbing the Uzi is way easier for dealing with the next Psychopath. We're go we, we should also heal. Yeah, yeah, we should. Yeah, we should probably also heal. Uh, I think we're gonna deal with Isabella first. Oh God, they're in here as well. Yeah, which I think that means we should probably take the long way so we don't accidentally trigger the next psychopath. Uh, I think, uh, oh, Jesus Christ. Well, well, what do you mean by trigger the next psychopath? Well, so there was a, a thing with the original version that if you walked in the, in the area where the next psychopath was, the survivors that she had with her would slowly die. I, and you should, you should probably, though, this, this guy should have learned not to, not to fucking approach. Also, I'm just, gonna, it, I'm just gonna throw this wasp away. I'm not sure if it was a glitch just to the PlayStation like like uh, version it, of the game, or it, if maybe it was just a thing for all of uh, the it, versions. It, it's not a thing for all the versions. That much I can guarantee. Okay. Don't you laugh at me, fuck fucking asshole. Yeah, she's dead. Not really my fault. Uh, well, here's... Yeah. Do you want me... To, so, how you would rather have me do it? Do you want me to go through convicts, or do you want me to go through, uh, shortcuts? You know, I guess let's take the risk, go through the shortcut. It, it, hopefully, the, the same the same thing doesn't happen the, in, in this version of the game, which hopefully it shouldn't. You know what? I'm gonna go heal up first, because these zombies keep fucking causing problems. And luckily, these cultists are way too far away to even aggro onto me. And worst case scenario, I can also just take the al alternate route of not going down the stairs and just jumping Jump jumping on this thing right here. There's a katana up here, by the way. Uh, it's, a good, it's a good early uh, secret weapon to have. Yep. Options. Audio, change them all, BGM. Let's just go the save theme from, uh... Hopefully this changes the music for, uh, convicts. So, like, I'm just mainly doing it just to be on the safe side. I highly doubt that. Okay, so that doesn't. Uh, yeah, you have to put streamer safety. I think you have to put streamer uh, sa uh, safety. So go to audio and background for streaming. Yeah, but not part of background the default. default. There we go. Man, if we just hug the wall, we'll be fine. Man, man, this seems sucks. Like seriously, this one actually this one actually sucks major balls. Yeah, but I, I I I would be sad if I was a streamer and was listening to this while dealing with the convicts. Yeah, because the, the best part of the convicts is it's the music it's the music you, you fight them with. All right, I I can now turn off uh, streamer safe mode. Okay, now is it? Oh, right, these fuckers are here as well. As long as, long as I'm up here, they won't bother us. Yeah, there's a lot of healing items up here. Worse, uh, because this next boss fight is going to be a bit annoying. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go grab. Uh... Oh, okay. Well, I guess these guys are gonna be getting hit by a 12 gauge. Oh, they're right there as well. Yeah, I was just about to say, I'm pretty sure they hang out in front of here as well. All right, well. 
We have plenty of time before we can do before we have to fight Isabella, so. Can I shoot through doors? Nope. Ha ha! He can't go through doors. Actually, you know what? I should probably just hit him once. Just gonna do this, hop back over here. Yeah, once we do this, we should probably head to girl hunting because we want to get above the law done in a timely manner as well. Yeah, because that's like four. Because there's like a bunch of survivors we get there. Again, we can ignore the last guy. Uh, there's actually a lot of survivors because there's the another set of secret survivors that we that we don't get a call about. Yep, but luckily they're easy to deal with. Do, 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 do. You know, it's whatever. It's only one health state. And it's better to take this shortcut compared to... Or go... It, wait, what? Wait, what? Oh, that's a book. Okay. <laughs> we, can ignore, we can ignore the cultists right here. Yeah, because they're about to despawn anyways. Now, it might be, now we better use guns in this other than Uzis, but shotgun is definitely useful for this next fight. Hey. Oh, we forgot to change our outfit. No worries, it's fine. There's a very... There was a specific outfit we wanted to wear for the seed, but we forgot. Oh, right. Yeah, I forgot. Ah, oh, well. Ow. Okay. I think you can get to the top of the boxes there and, and be able to still get her. Oh god, you need to heal. Yep. That's the plan. Ow! Excuse me, ma'am. Madam, you are being uh, very rude right now. Holy fuck! That is Jesus yes. Christ! They made her really annoying this go around. You know what? I'm wondering if I wondering if I should just run up to her and just It's always the chainsaw that's the easier solution to this. It's a solution to everything. Wait, I've got to talk to you. Would you listen to me? I'm not here to hurt you. I just want to talk. And what do you know about all this anyway? Are you a reporter? Eh, at least this outfit kind of works, too. Yeah. I won't run, so let go. You're hurting me. How much do you already know? Have you called for help? Hold your horses, babe. I'm the one asking the questions here. What is Santa Cabeza, and how is it connected to all this?
The zombies were created by you, not us. That's what Carlito wants you all to know. Who? If you want to interview someone, talk to Carlito. He has all the answers. You're talking about that guy that took pot shots at us with a sniper rifle, aren't you? Take me to him. No. Not now. He's injured. And in no mood to talk to anyone. I'll bring him to you once he's recovered. I can persuade him. And his little sister, after all. Yeah, this is where it gets revealed that their uh, Corlito and Isabella are indeed related. Why should I trust you to bring him to me? The zombies are message from Carlito. He wanted people to know. Frank's like, okay. Fine. Go. <laughs> when will you be back? Tonight at midnight. Wait for us in the store next to the camera shop in the North Plaza. Isabella, by the way. And I promise, I'll come back. Oh, then. Uh, I'm. We're gonna make a quick detour back to the uh, security room so we can change outfits. Man, we got way too, we got way too much we need. Actually, what am I fuck, what the fuck am I doing? Oh, we got suplex. Uh, if anything, I would deal with. Ugh. That guy. Hold on. Yeah, so we have about the same time to do deal with the snipers to deal with. Uh... We, we got access to into the motorcycle now. Yeah, motorcycle makes traversing North Plaza a lot faster. And then that can happen. All right, we're gonna set the sound to Shim to Shimmer only, just so we don't have to listen to Gong Guru again. Like I love that song, but unfortunately, I don't want. I was only allowed the one episode. Single, yeah, I'll, we don't I'll, want every episode to get fucked over because of it. Yep. Yeah, I'm, all, I'm fine with the one episode getting copyright claimed due to it. You know what? I'm going you know to talk about copyright law right now. I think it's kind of stupid that they can get slammed for... for Because a game, because the game developer decides to have uh, copyright music in the game. And these uh, record companies think it's okay to go go like, Oh yeah, this guy's making a video playing a game that that they gave uh, that we gave our, them a license to use our music for. We should... Uh, fucking copyright claim them that's like fucking horse shit oh these yeah. guys are... oh they are clo oh god they are locking in you, uh, you, you should run <laughs> yep i don't have quick step they're kind of bad shots though i rounded the corner so they can't really get me now Uh, I think we should probably deal with above the law first, and then. That's, yeah, because, yeah, because they they because like there's two survivors for, uh, for above the law, or sorry, there's two survivors for snipers, and I, if I recall correctly, there's like four or five for the other one. Yeah, there is a total of I think four or five, and that's not counting the two the two um secret survivors. <laughs> Yeah, which, speaking of which, I'm going to make sure to have...
Yeah, what? Which uh, I'm going to make sure to have a queen on me for for those survivors. I hate how I hate how aggressive the zombies can be. Yeah. For no reason, like it's like. Being instantly grabbed for because they decided to, to, to dash for you a millisecond seems really stupid. Anyway, I think I, I got an outfit in mind to deal with uh, above the law. Oh. You learn anything new on this end? Santa Cabeza is a stronghold of the Central American drug trade. I'm kind of glad I went back to the uh, security room now. Zombies are a byproduct of these drugs. So you're telling me, what, that somebody spread a bunch of zombie drugs around Willamette? For what? What would making the dead come to life accomplish? They're terrorism. Don't try to explain their action with logic. I've analyzed the drug in question, and I've reported my findings to the government. <coughs> that must be what set them off. <coughs> they didn't want to be... exposed. <coughs> Yo, Barnaby, are you doing all right, man? Everything I know. Now get me out of here. <coughs> Call for help and kill those creeps. Something seems fishy here. Yep. Anyways, we're here now. Uh, I got an outfit in mind for this. Actually, uh, no, I got, I got, I got an even better outfit. Yeah, because I was, I was hoping to set for you to save that clip. Also, Barbie would just be chilling in here, by the way. Um, let's see. You know, yeah, I really don't need a shotgun. Oh, I don't even have any healing. Shit. Yeah, you right. probably drop one of the shotguns and... I can't. Uh, I don't know how to, how to probably, uh... Oh, drop things, yeah. Yeah, yeah. you know, because I know you can drop stuff if you have a full inventory. Oh, well, that saves me from needing to... Drop things. Drink, uh, drink a thing for one. Oh, we gotta be. Nice. Yep. Oh my god! Calm the fuck down, zombies! Fuck off! What am I supposed to do with a stun gun? You know what? No mercy. You die. You die. You guys die. Out of the way. I'm a man on a mission right now. I need to get healing. To save the women. Yep. Yep, yep. Yeah, you heard you heard right, folks. We're gonna have we're gonna have a harem uh very soon. Oh come on, what do you guys have to be spread out? Fucking assholes, a lot of them. Well, since we're pro we're probably not gonna get kidnapped by the cultists. There, it, when they do kidnap you, there is a uh, a area they take you to, which you can actually pass if you're if you're outside. The door to it is outside. Mm -hmm. uh, there are two PP stickers in there, so if you want all the PP stickers, you have to at one point let them kidnap you so you can get both PP stickers. But it's not that worth it. Yeah, like if you want to try and grind level ups. You're 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 always you're always better off uh, just just kill killing uh, killing the cultist, 
Killing another set of enemies you'll find uh, later down the line. And then there's a... There's tons of PPE stickers that are available in the actual mall that you don't, you, you don't have to get kidnapped for. Yep, exactly. There's plenty. Yeah, there's plenty of other ones. That... Yeah, and then uh, I can. Yep, I can play, drop the shotgun now. I'm gonna. So I'm gonna grab just a regular pistol. Main reason why is that uh, you can act. So the survivors in this uh, particular boss fight, you can accidentally kill them. Yeah, so having so at least some kind of firearm will actually help a bit more. Yep, and considering you can actually, you know, move around now, that makes that makes things really, really useful. Let's see. Hopefully, the secret survivors don't die immediately. Because you spawn in near the uh, near the place they would spawn in. Unless unless they're on the other. Actually, they might be on the other side. Uh, they're so. on, they're on, they're on the other side. They're on the uh, other freaking. Yeah. So they. If you, go, if you go to the left side, which we'll deal we'll deal with them once we get to checking out the survivors that we actually need. I think it's on the uh, cross. Across yeah. Yeah. I see. Yeah. I see. Yep, it's this is the uh, area. Yeah, it looks like all of them are still alive. Yeah, because we didn't we didn't go through this area at all. Here. Looks like you lured another man in here, you little whore. No, I didn't. I... Please help me. Look at that skin texture. Let's see just how shameless you are, you dirty little skank. Say hello to my little friend. Ugh. Um, just seeing this, officer, just seeing this uh, absolute officer, C word makes me just want to blow her brains out immediately. I mean, uh, look, what did that woman do? This seems a little, uh... Shut your pie hole! If you try to interfere with official police business, I'll start with you before I get to her. <laughs> Well, it looks like we have. Well, Kai, it looks like we're gonna have to kill this woman. Yeah. And if you want to be technical about it, we're police right now, so we can we can yeah, interfere. We... Yeah. Yeah. The idea here is to try and lure her towards you, because if you lure her. If you like, if you get her away from the uh, from the other survivors, yeah, she will use her, her she will use her survivors as uh, to... yeah, the, uh, like of oh. Oh, they added a quick time event for her. I... Interesting. Okay. That's enough. Okay, so one thing I don't understand... How does she really die here? Like, does she have a heart attack? Does she... Like, does he, like, die from an aneurysm? Like... This is easy. Yeah. I'm pretty sure this is everyone's least favorite uh, psychopath in this game. But yeah, considering the amount of women that are in this uh, store, it, it was believed that Tanya was going to be taken by this psychopath and Ross yep. protected her. 
face. Are you all right? Sucked. Okay, we got three. Under, Are you all right? There used to be a there used to be a glitch with this uh particular uh set of survivors. I think it was only if you were playing on like a PlayStation Four. It was, it, was the, it was the remastered version of the original Dead Rising one. Also, I'm gonna give one of these. Hold hands. I, you can actually give one of them the gun, so that's what I'm going to do. Oh, the cultists are right there. Uh, we should probably we should probably okay. go this way. There they are. And there they are. Oh, and they're not. Either the fucking zombies haven't spawned yet, or they made it easier to get them. Well, in that case. Oh no, that destroys it. Oh no. Oh well, I can always get. You know what? I can get quick step from the food court, so you know what? That works out. And then. Okay, now we just gotta get the other one. Actually, you know what? That is free PP right there. And just like that, you just. They definitely changed it to make it easier to get them, because there used to be zombies all around them. Yep. It was a nightmare. Yeah, that makes things really easy. Come on! Come on, girls. Let's not dilly-dally. Come on! Yep, so, uh... I don't know what the best course of action is to bring I them. would go through the... I would, I would heal them up here, uh, but I would not go the other way, because you're going to go by the entrance... Snipers. Yeah. So you are not, and you are not taking this many people outside. Mm -hmm. That is not going to end well. So yep. your best course of action is just to heal them up here, uh, grab a healing item for yourself, and uh, take the bathroom. Yep. Okay, because let's see. Because there's plenty of wine here. Look at that. Looks like a cool photo op. No. Where? I I don't know where they were talking. I don't know. Oh, right no. there. Hold on. I have plenty of time. Let me do that right now, actually. Perfect. Excellent. Nice. All right. Uh, the blender is unfortunately on the other side here. Oh wait, no. It didn't. It's actually in the food court itself. Yeah. Follow me. So if anything, I might you, you might be good leaving the. Uh, actually, there's not a lot of zombies in this. Area. Yeah. If anything. Can, yeah, we can It'll leave them here. Deal with zomb. Uh, we can leave them here. Deal with the. Uh, uh, deal with the snipers, which shouldn't be too hard. I'm making my. Oops. No, I don't think I want to leave them here because you gotta remember they do die slowly. So I think we should just take them back. We'll deal with the snipers, because all we gotta do is just walk into the next area next to the safe room. Jesus Christ. Really, dude? How is it the females are the most capable people here? Okay, we're gonna go- we're gonna go ahead- Oh, the cultists are here, shit. Oh, God! Girls, quickly, quickly, because the cultists can actually fuck you up. Come on. Okay, Come on. back towards the bathroom. Hey! 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 Get out of here! Come on! Why is Kate the only capable person in this god in this goddamn uh, group of misfits? Alrighty. Drink up. Let's see, and then... Ooh, Janet likes wine. Oh, Janet likes wine? Oh, here you are. Eggs are... I, th I think it, it popped up... It, it popped up above her head that she, she, that she wanted the wine. Yep. Follow me! Let's see, and then there's... There's some... A few more... There's some corn here, so...
Yep. Yeah, so... Can we... Oop. Oh my god, game! I'm just trying to pick up the... The stupid fucking... Zucchini here. Jesus Christ, they... <laughs> That's charge. a lot of people who like zucchini. You're so kind as you beat the shit out of someone trying to get out of the, the matter your way. Yep, okay, so we got one. Okay, we got... We got the four survivors, and then we got the two hidden ones. Alright, we should be... We should be good uh, to traverse uh, through here. Through the bathroom. I don't think we ever got the cowardly one, which... Uh, ca cowardly person, which I think that's the first law scoop we, we lost. Yeah, technically. Unfortunately, com on, uh, uh, not convicts, uh, these assholes are right there. But luckily, we're not within the range uh, for them to start aggroing. Okay, kill these. Yeah, that one I'm already not, aware not about. Time, honey. Yeah, but now's not the time. Follow me. Okay, we got one, two, three... Yeah, Kay's the most useful uh, survivor out of, out of the out of this harem here, and Nick. <laughs> the harem and Nick. And that and that's just because Kay you can actually give uh, a weapon to. So, so you can actually, so you can actually uh, arm her with something, and she will actually be useful. The only thing that sucks about these guys is that they tend to push each other a lot. Come on, follow me. Okay, I think uh. Yep, everyone should be here, because as soon as we get, as soon as we head into the other room. Uh, yeah, that's everyone, because I see four. Yeah. Yep, no, yeah, no, no, there's no names that are in the corner saying that they're dying slowly, so we're good. Yep. Come on! I think the only thing you have to worry about over here is the that are over in this area. That yep. are right by the door. And even then... Even then, uh, actually... Man, zombies... You can put them into one of the stores. Uh, and maybe have them go into the children's store for the moment. Yep. Let's see, I'm gonna grab the Uzi and then I'll start shooting, uh... And I'll be killing some of these cultists. Okay. Oh, and they were gonna do an anniversary. What horrible timing. Uh, they are- oh god, what is Kay doing? Okay, okay, please go just listen to directions. Come on! Okay, we're gonna... Oh. I killed enough, I killed enough of them. Come on! I killed enough of them to where they won't be a factor. Okay, get out of the way, please. You're the most useful one here. We do not want you to die. Yep. Point taken. Oops. Yep. Okay. God damn it! Nick is Nick is the most useless one here. Let me go grab him because he's being a uh, a literal 
mm, a, a, a literal R word right now. Yeah, we don't need to be saying that word. Yep. No, big control. <sighs> Where the fuck is he? Uh, just spam the thing. Because she's walking toward. Uh, there he is. Because, yeah, you don't want to. Have Kay run into the cultists because she is keeps wanting to run to them. I'm sorry, but she's she's very headstrong, and I don't blame her because she just got it. She just got out of being kidnapped, so don't blame her. I'm sick and tired of these goddamn zombies. You don't see the girls who were literally kidnapped by a crazy woman freaking out as much as you are. Should be fine. Oh, yeah. All of them should be here. Uh, unless Kay decided to leave behind and shoot some zombos. Nope, all of them are here. Excellent. Yeah, this was a bitch to deal with when we didn't have the ladders, uh, the stairs there, because, oh god, they would. Do you see how they're football attacking? They all football tackle, so they would football tackle by that ledge, and it would take forever to get everyone off. Yep. I like I like the man standing next to you. I know. And we gotta level up for that, because that was a lot of people. Oh, we finally got knee drop. Excellent. We no longer have to, we no longer have to take the elevator now. So, if I had to guess... Yep, it's, it still works the same way. Yep. Which means we can take the shortcut now. Yep. Yep, so... I'm assuming they haven't changed anything about the, uh... Oh, well, we're heading there now. <laughs> oh, wow. Yep. I wanna I'm gonna go grab uh another uh healing item real quick. Cause the plan is the is the plan is to quick step and run towards the uh the snipers. Because I know the original they barely do any damage to you. And I think they're and I think and I think it was purposely designed to not do any damage to you. Because because there's three snipers and they and if all of them decide to they could just stun lock you. Mm -hmm. So so they made so they made it so uh they won't stun lock you anymore. Yeah, we but we I I think we're gonna be fine with time. Oh my we, really they decided to spawn the, They decided to spawn that <clears throat> Honestly, I think my main complaint as of right now is that I think there's just I think they I think the game spawns way too many cultists now. Yeah, which I mean, it's luckily will not be a problem much uh, later at least. Yeah, once once we deal once we deal with the cult leaders, the, the cult basically disappears. Unfortunately, we're not at the uh, moment where we can actually deal with them. Yeah, we still got time before that happens. Oh wait, we're, we're making good timing with this, uh, with the story at least. We're getting pretty decently far in there. We're yep. on day two. We're at night of day two, so we're really only got one like day left, and a little bit more, obviously. But yeah, Ben, we're starting. To, uh, we're starting to get a lot more inventory space, which is which is nice. We have like two slots open. You know what? I'm gonna make. You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna make another mixed drink. Yeah, might as well. Because just be, just be safe. Just just to be safe, 
Because I, because you never know if they, uh, if they buff the damage that the, uh, that that these, that these snipers do. Oh. Again, I don't like, I don't like how the prioritization works uh, for this. Okay, time to deal with those snipers. Yep. And some survivors. Yep, I think I'm gonna deal with the. uh... Because we I, we have another one of those case uh, case scenario survivors like the lovers where you have to find two of them. I believe because I believe this is the one that. Uh, oh yes, that is right. I if I recall correctly, I think this is the the one. Let's see. We're gonna go over. We're gonna go over a bit this episode, but we want to try and get this done as soon as possible. Yeah, might as well get it done. So the next thing that we have to deal with is a. Looks like 72 yards. I can blow his head off clean from here. Can I take a shot, Dad? Getting a headshot from here is no big deal, Jack. Think you can pull it off, Thomas? But Daddy, he ain't no zombie. He's just a man. Thomas! We're doing this to survive. You know that. Using a firearm for self-defense is our God-given right as Americans, Thomas. Come on, Thomas. Shoot. Shoot him. Shoot him, Thomas! I said shoot him. Shoot him, Thomas. Now! What are you waiting for? Do it! Don't peer pressure the poor kid. I feel bad for him. Yeah, Thomas is another sympathetic person. You know, unfortunately... You, you unfortunately have to... Uh, yeah, take him out. Take him out. You cannot spare him. But Which you, makes sense because we do kill his father. Oh, they're just gonna... Oh, they're just gonna make this easy for me, huh? I'm gonna put you out of your misery first, Thomas. Nothing personal. I... You know what? Sorry, I can't think you're angry. Oh, you know what? You know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave him alone. I'll leave him last. I feel bad for him. Yep. Quick step. Uh, unfortunately, ran out, but. Get back here. Okay, uh, do you have the Uzi on you? You, sir, are a fucking asshole. You don't... Oh, like oh, you can rattles kick after dodge rolling. That's actually pretty neat. Oh. Uh, roundhouse kick originally works. You have to jump and then you press the attack button. So I'm wondering, if they either change it where you have to do it after a dodge roll or you can now do it after dodge rolling. Get back here. You can't outrun me. Man, they run all the way. Sorry, Thomas. We're still going to leave you for last. Even if it means we have to chase your brother down. <laughs> yep. Yeah, honestly, I think... No, this, we should, I think this, anything, we might need to hurry. Yeah, I think this is the only thing that's annoying. It's just these fuckers are running away. You Asshole. Have a gun on you? What's that? Oh wait, no. He th okay. Thomas. Uh, Thomas is st uh, is on the ground. I think you get him. Now. Oh, I'm I so feel so bad. I'm sorry, little man. Actually, hold on. Can I actually talk to him? That'd be an interesting change. 
Can I talk to him now? I just saw Daddy and Jack like that once before. Wait, we can actually save him? All this happened, they became so excited. They said they'd been waiting for a day like this. I'm, uh, yeah, I'm sorry for your loss. I guess he deserved this. He shot at you first, after all. I, uh, I, I could take you somewhere safe if you want. I'm staying here with my brother and daddy. You can't just leave them behind like this. Uh, I see. Hang in there, kid. It's okay, Daddy. Jack, I'm right here with you. You what? Aww. I'm sparing him. All right. Let's... No, fuck it. No, no, no. Fuck Floyd. You you want me to leave him? You want, you want, you want me to leave him no, behind? No, fuck him. I, I don't want to deal with him later. All righty. Plus, he is he take he talks way too fucking much, and we are pressed for time on woman, uh, the woman who didn't make it. Yep, the other guy he could just chill around here for the moment. Actually, we can grab him first, honestly. Yeah, grab him first, then we can find. You still alive? <laughs> oh shit! Don't worry about. I didn't mean to skip that. Took care of it. No one's gonna shoot you now. Really? We should get moving before some other weirdos show up and replace the snipers. Let's go. I was waiting for a tough guy like you to take care of business. Get me out of here, man. Huh. If I recall correctly, you can actually give him. Uh, I think he's also pretty good with a gun. Surprisingly he enough. He is one of the very good uh, ones with guns. Uh, okay, so. I believe they're. They're on the right floor. I believe they're. Are they in here? No. Okay, they're not in here. I think the one girl is in the, the kids' store, which is, I think, next to here. Yeah, hold on. Okay, I'm not, I don't think it's the kids' store. I think there's two kids' stores. Oh, she's in, yeah, she's in that one. She's in Graham's kid. Uh, yep. Hey, you. Help me out, will ya? My friend. Fuck you, we're helping this lady. What? What happened to this Rachel girl? She got left behind on the second floor. The zombies probably already got there. Well. Like, I think you gotta talk to her more first. Wait, really? I think she, th yeah, I think you gotta talk to her. Keep talking to her. You said for her, right? I'll go check on her. Wait here. Okay. Oh, no. No way. Now you should be yeah, you're good to go. Wait. Oh. Now cuz then she'll join you. You're just going to head upstairs. She should be in she should be in one of the women's stores upstairs. I think they changed the store that she's in cuz she says for her. I think she, originally she was in ladies space. Yep. Yeah, these, uh, these, oh wait, I'm going the wrong way. Yeah, you're going towards the entrance entrance of the mall, so. Come on! Follow me! Yeah, and, and if you're wondering why we didn't just take Floor, uh, Floyd, Floyd is another one of those survivors that he is a mutiny survivor, a possible mutiny survivor. Well, well, uh, well it, but here's the thing. He doesn't really cause too much of a mutiny. His whole, sh his, like, his, he really, he's more of a survivor that actually oh. has a request. Well, if you want to save him, I did, you know what, it's your decision. We do so have to just sit through a lot of dialogue. Yep. Follow me! Jolie, I, I would stop pushing zombies and, and trying to, Follow me, so this is cosmetics. Wait, 
Kicks for her? Is that what is that what we need to go to? Uh, yeah, check. Well, she said for her, so yeah, check for uh, kicks for her. Doesn't look like she's here. Okay. Um. Okay. Yes, we're um, aware. Game. We're... Okay. Uh, turn, turn right. Okay. Go down. Go down. No, no, no. You, you went too much right. <laughs> turn right here. I think she's somewhere over here. I, at least from my memory. There it is. Oh, there it is. Here's the. Here it is. Honey, calm down. Oh, this is a photo op. Yep. Perfect. Oh, and we got the Sorry. costume back for yep. the issue we had gotten in the fair party. It's okay, Jolie. You came back for me. That's all that matters. Huh. Rachel, I... I'm sorry. Okay, uh... Chance I could get you ladies to continue your conversation in a safer place? I'll escort you to the security room. Follow me. Considering right. uh, promised to Isabel, I think we should just leave Floyd. It, yep. It is what it is. Yeah, Floyd yeah, is Floyd's not really worth it. Like, he, like there's he, one achieve ooh, like no. I'll like there are a few survivors like those survivors that we're avoiding that causes mutinies or have requests. They require for a, a uh, achievement called transmissionary. And once this achievement is is you have to answer all of Otis's calls. I'm not sure if it's still in this game. I would assume yes. Come on. So if you want all the achie if you want the achievements for that, that then you Fresca, have to get we need to go. Guys. Oh, I think we. Oh, do we leave up? No. Okay, El Fresco, where? Oh. Uh, I think you have right to, here. You have to go. Yeah. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on, please. Look at that zombie trying to bitch slap Wayne. Okay. We should make it. If anything, we might have to just deal with Isabel, uh, uh, Isabel real quick and then. Crap, I don't know. I, I... How much? How much? We are. We are 20 minutes. Almost 20 minutes over. Okay, then if anything, we can take these guys back and then if, if, if we want to stop it. Yeah, I think I think that's probably the the best course of plan. Come on. Okay, everyone's here. Yeah, we'll just have to haul ass to uh there once we get to the next case. We have some of the best of the box. Yep. <laughs> Alrighty then. We nope, this was pretty productive. We saved a bunch of survivors. Yep. And As we level up, even we, more. Oh, we got wall kick now. Sweet. And hammer throw. Okay, so wall kick is the same as it is. Hammer throw. RBX simultaneously while standing at the cyber side. Okay, so they're still doing it where it, there's it's specific positioning. That's mm. kind of stupid. But anyway, folks, 
I think that's it for today's episode. If you guys enjoyed enjoy the content, please consider subscribing as we will as we will really appreciate it. Uh, and be sure to leave a comment and a like as it'll help the channel grow. And with that being said, we'll see you guys in the next episode where we're gonna meet up with Isabella. Yep, we got a lot to do. We're gonna be meeting up with Isabella and hopefully find out some more information on what caused this zombie apocalypse. With that being said, uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Till then. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.